Hi and welcome to our very first survival guide. My name is Michał and in this short video we'll be chatting about the importance of water in Green Hell. Green Hell is a survival simulator focused on maintaining basic human needs and the water is obviously one of them. You can keep track of your hydration level on your smartwatch and if it gets low you will need to drink. The Amazon rainforest is full of water sources, like rivers or ponds. Even the falling rain can create a new one by making small puddles or filling up the dry riverbeds. But you can't just drink anything. Unsafe water may contain very dangerous parasites. Sure, drinking it won't kill you immediately but the parasites will consume you from the inside, increasing your needs not only for food, but water as well. So, some better solution could be collecting rain before it hits the ground. Boil dirty water to cleanse it of its parasites. Construct an apparatus to filter the water, or even build something that will collect moisture right from the air. But what if there is no rain or water source, you may ask? In that case, you can always look around for juicy fruits or knock down a coconut and then get to its life-saving water. <gasps> After that, if your levels are good, the empty coconut shell will be perfect to craft some water containers allowing you to carry additional water and keep you hydrated on your long journeys. Thank you for watching and see you in Green Hell.